weapon in public speaking? I would say my secret weapon in public speaking is that I'm not afraid to make mistakes. exactly what my topic should be. How should I introduce myself? It consumed a lot of time. One week ago, I was called on for my first table topic. I was a bit nervous, and I came up here and I was asked the question, what do you do on payday? <laughs> <laughs> my, my response was that, well, to this month, payday is a Tuesday, so I'll go to work. And, I, and I, after that, I thought, well, that was kind of rude. What, 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 uh, I should have entertained the question, and, and instead I gave a curt response. And, and I thought about it after that for a few days. I thought, what a, what a mistake I made. I, I, should have, I should have elaborated more. I thought back to a time when I was young. I was on a trip with my family to the beach for summer holiday. And uh, we stopped to get some gas in the family minivan. And... I went into the mart to use the facilities, and I saw a toy car that I had to have. Well, being, what, six, I didn't exactly have a steady income, so uh, I just took it. And uh, we went back into the car, and my mom said, Kevin, where did you get this toy car? And I said, well, I just took it. Well, you can't just take the car. You have to pay for it. So Dad turned the minivan back. We went back to the gas station. Mom said, please go inside and tell the man what you did. I'm sobbing. I went in. I'm sorry. I stole this. Smiling. So I took the car and I gave it to the man. And, went back and we continued on the trip. And, you know, you don't remember a whole lot of things from when you're five years old, but that sticks in my head until today. And I think about that, you know, what a valuable lesson my parents taught me in, in terms of honesty and, and, and in terms of owning up to your mistakes. And I thought, you know, maybe this table topic that I didn't really entertain, maybe, maybe, maybe this is a valuable lesson. Maybe I need to think about this. And, you know, I think when we make mistakes, we need to examine those mistakes and realize that something good can come from that. From stealing that toy car, I learned a valuable lesson in honesty. I learned that I need to own up to my mistakes and that I need to be responsible for, for what I do. When I gave that table topic speech, speech I thought, no, I, I, I could have done better. Maybe there's an opportunity there. And then it hit me. My icebreaker should be about mistakes. I, I should focus on, on when something bad happens, what good can come from it. As you know, I'm a very meticulous person. <laughs> I don't believe that everything happens for a reason, but I believe that there's a reason that things happen. I believe that if you look back retrospectively, you can see that something that I did, maybe it was bad, maybe it was good. Either way, I can take something from that. I can learn a valuable lesson from that. So I think we need to think about that. When you do something that you're not too confident with, when you do something that you feel like is a mistake, pay attention to that. Think about that. What good can come from that? Because I believe something lies within our mistakes. Thank you.